What's your favorite boba flavor? Mine's probably mango. What's yours? Ow. Hi everyone, welcome back to today's video. So we're going to be taking a look at some nice hidden details, hidden changes within this new Bloxburg Summer Update. Some of these aren't really hidden, they're kind of just like out there and you can find them pretty easily. But you know, I just wanted to make a video pointing out the cool things that are you know, around the map and kind of some stuff in build mode i guess yeah yeah i only found eight things and i got some of these some of these from the comments as well so thank you guys for letting me know many of you point out some really cool stuff i'm also in a hurry to record this video because i am going to be on vacation for the weekend so if i miss stuff that's expected okay i'm probably gonna miss a lot of hidden actual hidden changes and whatnot all right so starting off with number one over here the picnic blanket is actually an item that you can um let me take let me get rid of this microphone you can actually pick it up you know you can use it and it'll actually be folded it kind of gave you this hint in the description like it's a foldable picnic blanket but it looks like this and yeah if you take it you can carry it around you know carrying it like it's some sort of lunchbox or something i don't know and you can place it wherever you want you know place it down then use it again right like you can do that you just can't do that and you don't even need to like fold it up to pick it up but pretty realistic if you fold it first now it does look a little strange on like elevated terrain so if you try to put it like i don't even know if i can place it here Ooh, it doesn't let me. I don't know. I think in some spots it looks a little weird. Could use some work. I'm trying. Okay, I'm trying. I'm trying to see if I can put this. You pretty much can pick it up and place it down. Yeah. But you can kind of have like that picnic role play that you've been wanting, you know? I'm going to put mine in the street. Boom. Let's have a picnic in the street. Let's not get hit by a car. Now, number two, speaking about this picnic blanket, it came with this new t material. It's actually called Big Plaid. And I thought this was something that we couldn't use from in build mode, but little did I know. I didn't check this before. We have a brand new material. They didn't mention this. Okay, they didn't mention this. You just had to like think. But yeah, you go to material. It's right here. It's called Big Plaid. Um, and yeah, you can use it on any furniture or wall if you like. I'm gonna make mine blue, of course. But yeah, I actually really like this texture. Expect some builds from me that uses this quite a bit. Yeah, that's fun. Yeah, brand new material, fun. So number three, another thing that you can do in build mode is obviously color your boba cups. All right, so you can recolor these if you don't like the kind of default look of your boba bubble tea plastic cups. You can click on any of them and change the straw color. You can change the actual color of the cup itself and um, you can even change the color of the actual flavor so you could actually be like clickbaity with this you know you could like you could give someone some straw <laughs> yellow strawberry flavored drink in a pink cup with a black straw you know like there's so much customization with these like new foods and obviously a lot of foods in this game especially plates and whatnot can be customized so this is not really like a new thing but it's just a fun little detail that you can do if you are opening up your own boba store bubble tea shop whatever colorful fun display this is a fun little detail so number four this lady right here that is in this summer update world food festival these actually um basically off an Oompa Loompa, Oompa Loompa lady. It's kind of like a meme from the Willy Wonka experience. This is what she looks like, okay? This was a meme. A lot of people probably know about this, but yeah, it's the Willy Wonka Oompa Loompa experience meme. Bartender, bartender, yeah. I think she's a bartender. But yeah, this is quite a, it's quite a photo circulating and you can kind of see that with this, like the brown, same brown shirt, the green hair, um, the face even the face like i knew like it was based off something you know it was oh and the white gloves you can see from like the white gloves from her lego hands <laughs> Oh my gosh. Yeah, this is what this character was based off of. So coming at number five, and this actually took me a while to find if you watch my update video. I didn't even notice this until like almost the very end of it. But there is a brand new like sort of party area next to the nightclub and the city hall. Um, I mean, this place is kind of used for like Tom's Tree Lot and I don't know what else it's used for, I forget. But this is a brand new thing for the summer update. Last year, we never had something like this before. And it's pretty much just kind of like this picnic area. You know, you would take your kids here, play the bouncy castle you would eat food you know just have that fun time and they even have like this market stall i'm gonna call it market stall you can like purchase hot dog ingredients or buy bacon and eggs um oh cool i don't have to make it yeah i don't have to make it so yeah if you want to you can just place the food here and eat it take a portion of it if you like you know i, I pretty much consider this sort of like a hangout party cookout area you know if you don't know where else to go other than your house this is a good place to be Brand new spot. Okay, so coming at number six, this is not a hidden detail. I mean, it is a fun detail, I guess. 
But if you don't really look close enough, I guess you could miss it. But there are water lanterns right here in this like river, you know, right under the bridge. I think it's very beautiful, especially at nighttime. You get a, a nice like glow from this water. So I'm really glad that they added this. It's a fun, definitely a fun detail. Definitely a fun detail. Not so hidden if you're really like, if you really look everywhere, but um, yeah, very cool. You don't really see this type of stuff. I don't know. I don't see too many water things, I guess, or at least I don't remember too many of them. But coming at number seven, all of the new food that came from this world festival um, can be made at home um, within your own fridge. But honestly, I recommend the experience of coming out here to actually get the food. It just kind of keeps you immersed in a way. Like I definitely recommend going out here. I don't know if you can make all of it, but most of them can be made at home. Let me just, oh, let me just like break my legs or something there. I'm going to show you guys. But yeah, if you go to like the ingredients within your fridge, you'll find a plate of lang langos, um, mandazi, empanadas, va vada pav. Sorry if I'm saying these wrong again. Oh my gosh. Serving of baklava, um, pot of curry. You got bunny chow. And yeah, a lot of things you can literally prepare yourself at home. And you actually kind of, you know, in a way it's kind of educational. You can kind of get an idea of how these things are actually prepared in real life. Um, and it's just really fun, a really fun experience. Now, if you go to Quick Meals, you can also find some new like a fried plantain plates, um, plate of dango, spring rolls, poutine, which is like a Canadian, like French from Quebec, I think. Plate of puff puff. Coxinha. Coxinha. You have a plate of coxinha. You'll be able to find like quick meals. Still recommend going there though, okay? Just for the experience and just kind of for the immersion, the realism, the realism immersion. All right, so coming at number eight, this is a very cool um, change as well, or it's not really a change, but like a cool addition, but you can find new picnic tables at the pier next to the beach. Yes, this is a way to make the summer update feel more interesting is yeah, you finally have a nice picnic table and you got some like string lights, fairy lights just around this one picnic table, I think. Oh wait, no, there's three. There's three picnic tables around here. So that's a fun thing. I actually love this like little triangle, but um, um, yeah, this is my last um, hidden change on my list. I'm sure I'm probably missing some other ones. If you do find those, let me know in the comments. I don't think I'll make a new video on those hidden changes, but at least other people will know about it. And yeah, this is really cool. The pier was feeling a bit empty, you know, and I feel like this should be like a permanent addition, you know? They should just keep this permanently. Now, it's as far as the World Festival food goes in terms of, I don't know if it's like limited or not for this type of event, I feel like it could be limited, but I would stock up just in case. I'll see if the devs um, kind of respond to that. Um, I'll let you guys know, but just in case stock up, I feel like it might be a limited food, especially like the boba or something. Maybe one day in the future, we'll be able to like make our own boba somehow. Like, look at this, this is new. But on that note, those are my quote unquote hidden details slash changes that came from this brand new Bloxburg summer update. Yes, once again, don't be surprised if I missed out on some more stuff. But on that note, that will wrap up today's video. Thank you guys so much for watching, and I will see you all in the next video. Bye!